Hey friends, this is Atif Hope here. Well, and welcome to the new update on Algorand. As in my earlier video, I was showing you this breakout from this long down channel and the formation of this broadening wedge. And in today's video, I would like to show you these moves once again. And I would also like to show you once again this huge falling wedge pattern that is formed on a weekly time frame chart. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member, because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. And if you would like to see how my trading signals work, then I've also shared the link for the current month trading signals report in the video's description. You just need to open that report. And for example, if you would like to check or verify any trading signal, like this is a trade setup for auction, you just need to click on the link for that trade setup and it will take you to the trading view. And there is a play button available on every trading views chart. You just need to click that play button and it will show you how the price and moved up from the buying zone and rallied to the sell target zone. And that was a quite massive pump, by the way, almost 300% on a four hour time frame chart. Now, let me to take you to the live chart of Algorand. And this is the daily time frame chart. And you can see that for the past several days, Algorand was moving inside this long down channel. And finally, we broke it out here. On uh, 23rd of June, 2023, we broke it out here, but got rejected by another downtrend line resistance that is coming all the way from here, from 17th of May, 2023. You can see we got rejection here, and this is another rejection, and this is the last rejection that we had here on 17th of July, 2023. And you can see the price line is also uh, testing the support of the pre that, that is in fact the previous resistance of the channel. Now it is uh, flipped into a support. And now it is forming uh, another broadening wedge, a falling broadening wedge on this daily time frame chart. But this time you can see it is still moving here sideways and found a support here that is approximately here at uh, 10.80. You can see previously it was breaking as support here. And uh, for several days, you can see again, it, it this level is working as support. And here it also worked as a support. You can see it slightly moved below than this support level. But after testing the support of the previous resistance of the channel as support, you can see it recovered very soon and now still moving above this support. And you can see this is also a kind of a descending triangle formation now. And we have a broadening wedge. We have a breakout from the down channel. And this is also a descending triangle. If I will place this. A trend line here, then this descending triangle will be more visible for you. Let me remove these trend lines as well. And you can see that we have stable rejections by the resistance and stable bounces from the support as well. And right now you can see that the price line is again moving at the support. On a weekly time frame chart, you can see that we have this long term support at 9.5 cents where the price line was forming this double bottom. Still, this double bottom is valid. You can see this is the first bottom. And this is the second bottom that the price line is forming. And after the formation of this double bottom, price line can break out the resistance of this falling wedge pattern very soon. Now, let's take a look at the targets. Uh, the target for this triangle, once it will be able to break out this resistance, uh, then the target will be here. That will be approximately at 18.59 cents. And the target for this channel is here at the top of the channel, approximately at 23.5 cents. And the final target, once the price line will be able to break out this wedge pattern, will be here at the top of the wedge. That will be between two dollar and fifty cents to three dollars. So this was the update so far. I hope that you've liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you, and you can find the link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.